You know, each week in Oklahoma, 300 people are admitted for crisis health services. Well, today we're celebrating a frontline health care worker who has devoted her life to patients with mental illness. Join News 4 and First Fidelity Bank and Allie Meyer as we pay it forward. Tony and Denise Foster raised their family in Tuttle, two boys and a precious baby girl, Ginny. Childhood pictures show no signs of the mental illness that crept into their lives Ginny's senior year of high school. It was pretty, pretty bad because I'm a Christian and, you know, I believe, you know, God gave us gifts and things that we can overcome. But this was, this was really hard. Jenny was hospitalized with extreme psychosis, crippled by hallucinations. Her diagnosis, paranoid schizophrenia, a lifelong disease. When uh, you have a child that's mentally ill, you feel so alone. <laughs> and Pat team is not alone anymore. You know, um, so few people understand unless you have a mentally ill child. Checking in with them. This is the PAC team, a superhero squad of mental illness professionals, nurses and therapists at the State Department of Mental Health. They are a lifeline for adults like Jenny. They help Jenny stay where she's supposed to be. And with her meds and with social interaction and with doctor's appointments, it helps me realize how important my life is. I just follow this. Lori Shy is Jenny's nurse. I don't know of anybody that could have more understanding and empathy and compassion for mentally ill folks than, than Lori does. How are your meds working for you, Jenny? Oh, good. Nurse Lori manages Jenny's meds. She drives her to appointments and she calls all the time to check in and check up on Jenny's mental health. In fact, Nurse Lori called. Oh, sorry. During this interview, <laughs> because she has no idea, we are two doors down, preparing to surprise her with four hundred dollars to pay it forward. <laughs> okay, Nikki, tell us why we're here. First Fidelity loves to recognize people who make a difference in our community. Nurse Lori represents exactly what Pay It Forward is all about. One, two, three, four hundred. Awesome. Thank you so much. We have tried so many times to give her gift cards or, you know, thank yous and, oh no, you know, I work for the state. I can't do this. <laughs> I'm not supposed to do that. Let's go. She's so honorable in that way. And so we just felt this could be a way of, of maybe being able to show her just a tiny bit of, of how much we appreciate her. Hi, I'm looking for Nurse Lori. Mm -hmm. Lori, my name is Allie Meyer. I'm from Channel 4. I'm with the Pay It Forward team. <laughs> How are you? <laughs> I'm great. <laughs> Jenny and her family have nominated you for a Pay It Forward Award because you go above and beyond in the way you care for Jenny and her family and all of your patients. Oh, y'all are so sweet. <laughs> Nurse Lori has spent her career serving and saving Oklahomans like Jenny. I just love this area of nursing. Thank you. She is lighting a path for patients lost in the darkness of mental illness. Every day, Nurse Lori pays it forward by bringing them back. Allie Meyer reporting. If you'd like to pay it forward, send your nomination to kfor.com slash pay it forward. Just a reminder, you can't be related to who you're nominating.